you've been waiting for. I got this from Walmart. It was for $2 after tax. It's a L24111 brush. It's for a foundation, but um, I'm gonna use it for my activated charm mask. This is a don't try at home <laughs> type of deal, but I like risky shit and try it out for myself. I do not try these at home. I've seen a lot of people pretty much tearing off their first layer of their skin. This is what I'm going to be using for my activated charcoal mask. Best of luck to me. Sometimes it's hard for me to show that I'm more than just a rumor or a song on your computer. There's more to me than people know. Some days I'm broke, some days I'm rich. Some days okay guys, so we are going to start the mask now. As you guys can see, everything has been blended in really nicely. It is like a charcoal gray black look to it. What I do want to mention too is that you don't want to go too close to any of your hairline. If you want to remove the hairs around your mustache, it will give you a free wax, so you'll be alright with that. Keep stirring this until it mixes well. And we're supposed to wait for like at least 20 to 45 minutes, but I've seen people doing it in under 30. So I'm gonna time myself once I applied everything onto my face. If you wanna wash your face, then go ahead and wash your face because what you wanna do is you wanna open your pores as much as possible so that the activated charcoal can go in there and cleans up the pores. And also put a wet cloth onto your face with warm water. Your pores will start to open and then that's when you wanna apply everything on there. Okay, so I went ahead and washed my face. So. So here we go. It's an ego, guys. And I'm here to suffocate myself. You can see these little bubbles. That's just in my pores opening up. I ain't trying to tear up my sideburns. Okay, so this is pretty much the aftermath. I still have like a lot of it left over. It actually doesn't smell so bad. Let's hope that it comes off. Let the time begin. I already cannot really talk. It's starting to stiffen up. <laughs> I can't even eat anything. Like, I can't even put it. This puff Cheeto into my mouth. Pro tip, eat before you do this. <laughs> oh my god, I'm drooling all over the place. Holy crap. No, my face got really itchy. I scratched my face and then this is what happened. 20 minutes later. <sighs> Everything is dry, including my mouth because I couldn't eat anything and couldn't drink anything. So that should really bother me. Anyway, so now you just have to find an area for which you can take off the mask. And when you're taking it off, make sure that you're doing it upward, not downward. Because you don't want to frown, you want to smile. I can't even smile. But you guys can kind of see that these are starting to dry up and it's starting to, the layer is already starting to come off. I can swear, I can joke, I see what ah. <laughs> It does hurt. They weren't lying. Ooh. Somebody might have to finish this for me. See, like by the chin, it's okay. But everywhere else, especially like right around this area, the cheek area is like uh, the most sensitive uh, spot. Ooh, that felt good. <laughs> that actually felt really good. Okay, so let me see if I can do the whole thing without tearing it because this is my first attempt. Oof. Mm -mm. I don't know if you could kind of tell, but my skin is already kind of like red right there. Ooh, because it's kind of irritating. <laughs> Nora, help me. Okay, so by the chin, it feels really good, but I'm a little afraid about the cheeks. Ooh. Mm. Oh. You don't want to rip anything off because you're going to definitely irritate a lot of the um, capillaries around your cheeks. So you just want to be careful. It helps if you smile as you smile and you just tear it up. Okay, halfway there, we can do this. Ooh, my face is really getting red. Let me tell you something. If you ain't ready for pain, you are not ready for this. <laughs> so don't try this out. Oh, oh. Ooh, you guys can see that? Okay, so my face is really red right there. But that's just because there is a lot of tension that is uh, going to be pulled off. 
Feel like I need to put eyes on my face because it's burning. I even tried to put oil on there to make it come off smoother, and that shit didn't do no good. I'm gonna go ahead and put a warm cloth around my face. My face is a little red right now. You can see the different color down there. So what I recommended, if you're not ready for pain, don't fucking do it. But I wouldn't recommend putting it anywhere around your sideburns or anywhere around looser skin right here. Like I said, I would recommend putting it on a tougher surface of your skin which is on your cheek, your lips, your nose, the bridge and a little bit of your forehead not the whole thing because even up here it was a little sensitive taking it off so I'm gonna put on a cool cloth to uh, kind of like let this heat go somewhere else instead of right here cause let me go ahead and clean this up these glue you guys can just take it off with the warm cloth I totally got slapped Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you guys got a good laugh. Subscribe to your girl. That way y'all don't miss any more clips from me. Comment down below what you guys think. So I will show you guys the aftermath of where my face went. Yeah, so you guys can kind of see some raises around there, which is, that is from the pore itself. Can't really give you guys a good enough picture because honestly this mask wasn't thick enough. So that's the aftermath, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this video. My face does feel so much smoother and I love that effect, but it's still irritating. So here we go. I really did irritate the crap out of this side though. Roughly 20-30 minutes of me just applying cold water. It is a lot better. You can, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it has gone back to my regular skin tone. So I am not too worried too much about it being bruised the next day. You can see like earlier it was like red here and then pale me skin here. Now it's back to normal so I should be okay. I should be fine. Golden. And then on here. Goodbye.